The process of rebuilding it, 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 it's one of the strangest things a designer can experience, to create something that intimate and that powerful, to then have it shipped down here in a massive trailer. In a way, this is the biggest set that either of us have ever worked on. From Jack's point of view, this set is a whole world. Because at the beginning you go, well, how do you sustain 45 minutes an hour in here? And then you're thinking, I wish we had two. One of Ethan's challenges was actually to build this set before right. the usual deadline. You know, the usual deadline is the shoot. And we actually dialed that back and we said, no, let's get it built early so that we can get the characters, get the actors to think about this place. I definitely began approaching the idea of room at a certain point in pre-production as a solar system. There were worlds upon worlds, but they all needed each other to function. Mm -mm. Everything was rotating around itself. From what I gather, people respond that way to the film, thinking that we've built several rooms within this room. Yeah, there are many locations within this one location. Like, I get excited when I talk about it because I, I still think, God, there are so many things that you could study in there that we didn't get to study. We never wanted to make a choice based on what would look good on camera. If anybody can ever notice that you've done something for effect, you fail. Lenny was very aware of this and smartly suggested we needed a way to get Bree and Jake to bond quickly. What better way to do that than to have them create art together? Yeah, because it's a situation where Jake could be with Bree but not feel under any pressure to perform or to chat. They could just get on with the making of something. So once we got past the technical aspect, I was standing in the room, it was a three wall set, and the fourth wall came in. My heart skipped a beat. All of a sudden I was back in the room. Coming back to it, I didn't think it was going to affect me, but actually it really did affect me. A little bit like Jack and my experience at the end of the film. I walked back in, I've been through this massive process of putting the film together, lived with it as a film, gone through releasing it, sat in the auditorium and watched it with an audience, and then, then suddenly to come back and go, wow, that all happened in here?